It's photo shoot day, right? Hey, hey masters. masters, it's photo shoot day. <laughs> so I am here with my friend Julia, who's a photographer. Just tell us about yourself. Hi, my name is Julia. I'm a senior in environmental engineering here at the University of Michigan. When I'm not crying about engineering homework, I am a professional semi-sports photographer for the Big Ten Network, and I also work for the Michigan Daily and freelance around campus. Awesome, so today we're gonna bring you to our top five favorite photo shoot places around Ann Arbor. So right now we are starting for a professional photo shoot in the Law Quad. Julia, why is the Law Quad great? The Law Quad is great because it, you see these arches over here, it filters so there's no direct sunlight. So it's great lighting no matter what time of day so I can schedule shoots throughout the whole day. Static background as well and so it gets a very clean shot and it's always great to have the arches in there as well. Awesome, let's go! <laughs> currently in the Ross School of Business. Julia, why do we like to come here? We like here because it's very bougie, because it's Ross, yep. so it's very aesthetically <laughs> pleasing. You've got the M Ross flags in the back, so business majors usually like to come here for their headshots, but also just the glass it has really cool reflections, and it's really bright in here because of the glass ceiling, so you don't have to, for photographers, you don't have to push your ISO so high, so it's less grainy, and it's very good options if it's raining for headshots, if you can't do the lock quad. Yep, very professional. Yeah. Driven in colors, I never dreamed. We are currently at Nichols Arcade, which is right off of State Street. Julia, what's the best part about Nichols Arcade? So this is classic old Ann Arbor, so you've got these beautiful arches and the old architecture. I think it's a great place for anyone who wants to capture Ann Arbor's old aesthetic. And same thing like the Law Quad is going to be soft light because it's all enclosed, but it's also going to be bright enough because it's got the glass ceiling. So great for photographing opportunities. Yes, and we're just in a casual outfit today mm -hmm. just for casual pictures. <laughs> We are in front of the classic Ann Arbor Wings. These wings are on Maynard and Thompson, kind of, right across from NYPD. Classic graduation photos. Classic Pinterest -y spot. Yeah. And not just for graduation, for anyone. I can get a picture in front of you every single year. <laughs> in front of the iconic big house. Julia, what do we normally do here? So here normally we, if it's a grad session, we have someone change from their formal cap and gown to a Michigan t-shirt, jeans, and white sneakers is the usual look. And then we just take pictures in front. This angle isn't that great, but if you get straight on, you can get the, um, the big block M scoreboard and the gate's really nice touch. And it's a really nice way to wrap up and juxtapose your uh, formal grad photos in the lock quad with something fun and casual and you get to show off all of your Michigan gear you spent too much money on exactly. during the school years. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> garage door in front of the Chrysler Center. Um, I actually did not know this existed, but yeah. the more you know. Very fun background, get a lot of fun. If you have um, people who are very flexible or have done gymnastics before, um, you can do some really fun jumping shots. Uh, just any, it really brightens up anything, especially when the big house is kind of not working with light. This is always gonna be the best bet, always gonna have soft light, so very, very fun. Hey. <laughs> Never letting go, now that I have it with you. 
Well, Madsters, thank you guys so much for watching. Julia is currently booking for 2023 graduation sessions. So go check out all the links that I put in the description below. She is awesome. I'm absolutely obsessed with all the pictures that she took. It was so fun. So let me know if you guys have any other questions. Feel free to contact her. Hope this was helpful. And if you see me on campus, please say hi. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, Madsters.